Okay, hey everybody, just making a video today for an unboxing. Um, this gentleman over here, by the name of Radical, I don't, I don't know, I, I, want, I don't want to mispronounce his name. It's Radical A U R A X. Uh, I have I have subscribed to him. He does a lot of videos, mostly unboxings, similar to mine, and uh, I think it's great that he's doing the videos. I think it, I think he should be promoted by anybody, including myself, because he is an avid gamer and he does enjoy the games that I enjoy. So good on him and uh, look forward to seeing more videos so after watching his videos there's a lot of differences not too many differences but a few to, to point out between mine and his so here's my copy of Brink it's on the 360 of course uh, I'm not too sure if it's going to be selling on the P PlayStation 3 most likely uh, but uh, here's the 360 version. This is not a pre-order edition. This is uh, Canadian retail. This is what they're selling at every Canadian retail store, which includes Walmart, EB Games, Future Shop, Best Buy. Uh, the biggest difference between the North American version and the Canadian version is the paper sleeve, of course. Um, so we'll just go over it. Paper sleeve. So it says Brink on the front. Uh, it's bumped. Everything, the objects on the front are bumped, as you can tell from the lighting, the gentleman, Brink itself, and the ARC logo. So, again, it says Brink has the ARC logo, and then you've got a gentleman over here, uh, I'm guessing he's going to be a rebel, and he has a Molotov cocktail in one hand, and a what I'm guessing is a handgun that has been modified over time. Uh, it's rated T for teen, it's developed by Bethesda, same guys that have made uh, Oblivion and Fallout 3, more notable titles. And uh, so here's the back. So it says Evolution and then in spray paint or blood. Pretty sure it looks like spray paint or some sort of paint. Uh, the Rebels have put an R. So instead of Evolution, I'll say Revolution. Again, you've got English and then French. Because that's a big thing in Canada. You have to have both. Or else those Quebecers, they get real angry. And, uh, so you've got no boundaries, teamwork is everything, near endless customization. There's a lot of mixed reviews for this game right now. I took a quick skim over the written review for IGN and they gave it a 6. Now, uh, that's pretty low considering how IGN rates games. But in the, in the review, they pretty much were comparing it to Call of Duty, which isn't fair. Call of Duty is on its own level, if you want to call it that. So, apples and oranges moving on so taking off the sleeves so again copy open it up get a quick sniff out of it no 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 okay so the front or inside you've got a leaflet with elder scroll elder scrolls skyrim speak they're definitely making sure this game's not going to be delayed they want it to come out on 11 11 11 november 11th of 2011 that's, Remem that's Remembrance Day in Canada for all you, all you uh, factoids. Uh, and then on the back you have Rage, another game being developed by Bethesda or published by Bethesda. Oh, I'm I'm lost now. I, it's developed by ID. No, ID. The guys that made Doom 3. Well, I don't know now. I don't know if Bethesda is a developer or publisher. Hmm. That's. If anybody, if I, anybody has the answer to that, let me know. So again, reminding everybody I'm in Canada, uh, you've got the English version and then the French version. Just take a quick look over the game manual. Oh, it's in color. Ugh. Oh, that's pretty neat. Okay. You got some different guns, different characters, so on and so forth. And uh, the game itself. Ah, damn it. So, that is the game. I also picked up the game guide for it for uh, $18. It's not a bad deal. If I was ever trade this game, I'll know at least that I owned it. But uh, the, the game guide looks pretty impressive on its own. Uh, it's all in color, a lot of pretty pictures in it, and uh, a lot of facts about the game itself. So, that is my unboxing. Stay tuned next Tuesday for LA Noir unboxing. And uh, if there's any questions or comments, send them down below. And uh, so just rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys all next week.
See ya.